Good morning. Um, so yesterday I, I wrote, are you worthy with uh, the mindset of a lot of what ifs, uh, things I think about song. But I'd be naive to, to think that not every art artist out there was not in on my downfall or lack thereof my downfall. Let's be honest here, the whole industry did not want to see me a part of the music industry. But what if I became the music industry? That's very possible, guys. Very possible. I mean, a lot of laws were broken by a lot of people. Not just in the physical. Oh, huge confirmation. Um, reality is that I know a lot about music. I know a lot about all of you. Before I had enhanced gifts. I know a lot about what all of you are about. And I see who, I see you for who you are now more than ever. Um, I know which artists are lazy and which aren't. I know which artists are honest <laughs> and which aren't where, are there any honest ones? No, there's not. Um, so would you be worthy? Would you be worthy of being a allowed to be welcomed into the industry? Because clearly I was not welcomed into the industry. But I will be. But will you? Um, that was what the song was about. What are you in it for? Because whatever gifts you have were given to you by God, whether you want to admit it or not, they were given to you by God. And... You used and abused those gifts for the wrong reasons. At one point in your life, you had a purpose that you turned your back on. As the Kiss song goes, God did give rock and roll to you. Great song. Great video. Great egos. But I like his. Always have, always will. Um, it's just amazing to think that A job like that, that much power that you have within you, especially if you're a top tier artist and you do nothing to help humanity. You pretend. Oh, you pretend. Do you ever pretend? But you do nothing to help humanity.
clearly, because the world has not gotten any better. It's gotten worse, especially after all this um, pretend healing stuff. It's gotten worse. The world has gotten worse. Why? Because you blocked my path as well. So what if the whole industry's karma was that I was now in charge of the industry and I got to choose which artists to keep around and which ones I'd banish? Because the way karma works is you get what you give and... There's a lot of artists I know are not good for, for, for the, the, the industry because the, they don't really put anything into the industry. They just take from it. Anyway. I respect... Musicians for what they can do to uh, inspire. If you're not an inspiring artist, what what are you there for? Your ego, your money, your drugs, your rock and roll, your girls, your guys. What are you in it for? The industry's gone to shit. It's literally gone to shit. And that's why I believe that the 90s was the last great era in music. And I've followed music since I was four years old, religiously. That was my religion. Confirmation. And I didn't just move forward. I dove into the past and uh, saw and heard music from the 50s, 60s, 70s, 80s I lived. So I know what was legit and what wasn't. I know what music has an impact and what doesn't. I know what music is just hot air. I know what music is talented and what's not. I know what music is the easy way out. And I don't like artists that take the easy way out. They are lazy. And we live in a lazy world and we don't need a lazy world and we don't need lazy artists. We definitely don't need artists that claim they started at the bottom and went to the top because they didn't do that. We need tr truth out there, but nobody speaks the truth. We need a rearranging of artists. We need true artists, as a lot of them are fake artists, but why not? We live in a fake world, or you do. I don't live in a fake world. I live in reality. That's what that song was about. 
if you and I had an interview, what makes you worthy to keep your position? What makes you worthy? Why should I even entertain you? Oh, I've been doing it for the... I don't give a fuck what you've been doing and how long. I've been doing it too, but I wasn't able to have the, the, the opportunities that you were able to have. Why are you worthy? What makes you worthy of being put on a stage to perform your music to people going forward in the progression of the world? I don't care what you, you, you wrote in the past. That's the past. That's depression. That's sadness. That's despair. Because you guys never chose to heal yourselves. You never chose to progress in life. Because that wasn't the trend. Let's stay depressed. The depressed was the 90s. And we just stuck with it. Where over time, I was like, what the fuck? And I just kept writing music to heal. But I, I couldn't get it out. Because I wanted to get better. I kept wanting to get better. <laughs> 